Kristen with Blazing Milestones. I'm a pediatric occupational therapist and mom of a 12 week old. Lately, Jason and I have been playing in side lying. Side lying is a transitional position. Um, we do it every day rolling out of bed where we're laying on our backs and then we want to sit upright. Babies do it when they are working on rolling. So they go from their backs to their bellies or their bellies to their backs. So side lying is a really important position for your baby to stay in and kind of maintain to work on those oblique trunk muscles because they're working both sides when they are in side lying. It's also a nice option for your baby if they're not really tolerating tummy time per se today or another day and you don't really want them playing on their backs all that much. So side lying is a nice position to still work on their core, still work on them going against gravity without them being on their tummies or on their backs. So I'm going to show you a little bit about what it looks like. I'm going to rotate Jace at his lower half and just kind of bring him onto his side here. Now he does not love um, sideline, he prefers tummy time. So we'll see how long he lasts. I'm gonna take my leg and just kind of put it behind his back so he doesn't flop backwards. It's important to support your baby so that they can maintain this position. When he starts to fuss, sometimes I'll give a little jiggle, 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 let him know that I'm here, but I put toys kind of in his visual field for him to look up at and kind of get some neck extension to kind of elongate the front of his muscles a little bit. He sometimes tries to roll. What you will notice here is that his hands are at midline together. This is a nice position to work on bringing your baby's hands together um, if your baby tends to stay more with their arms out wide. So it's a nice midline play. It's a good way to visually engage your baby and kind of limit them when they're on their back. They can turn their head and see everything. When they're on their belly, all they can do is lift up or look to the side. So in side line, you're kind of limiting their visual field a little bit. If you really want to hone in and engage with them, you can lay down next to them and try and get their attention that way. Yeah, you're going to try and reach for Elmo? So all I'm just going to do is kind of rock him a little bit, get him used to and comfortable in this position. Sometimes he tries to roll and he'll lift up against gravity. Right now he's chilling in this position, which is nice to see. And I just try and move some of these toys. Where Elmo go? Where Elmo go? Do, 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 do. You don't feel like moving today? You're just gonna chill in this position, even though I told everybody you don't really like it. So he's not fussing, which he normally does in this position. I do the right side and the left side evenly. So just make sure that when you are playing with your baby, you put them on either side, you support their backs, whether with your leg or some sort of stuffed animal, pillow, something to keep them propped and just help your baby engage in this position because it'll be really important. See, as I pushed him forward more, he's trying to lift up. It'll be really important for rolling. Gonna go. If you have any questions or concerns about your child's development, talk to your pediatrician. You can also contact me to set up a session to work on ways of promoting development in your child.